as Nate would say, hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey from Nate. Yes, he's not with us today, but he sends his hey, hey. <laughs> he certainly does. <laughs> and we are having a special edition today of Pattern Haul from... Yes, from a Facebook site. I'm not on Facebook, but Doris, Dory had me go with her and ordered off of the site. So, because they have really cool prices on patterns. Yeah, so it was that de-stashing pattern site. And um, most of these were $1.25 each. Yes, yes. So, that's pretty good. It is. Yeah. Yeah. And they're all, the ones we purchased were all factory folded, meaning nobody's used them. Yeah. So, they're new. Uncut. Uncut. Unused. Yeah, and it's nice that there's sites out there because so many of us buy patterns. Yeah, with and the intention of using them, and then we don't, and then it's like, oh, well, how do I get rid of them? Well, the thing I like about this site is um, there are people who have commented, some of our viewers have commented, so we don't have those kind of sales around us. We don't have a yeah. Joanne Fabrics that has it for $1.99 or two ninety nine or whatever. Or Fields Fabrics for three ninety seven. So there is a way for you that if you don't have any of those stores near you, you don't have to even leave home. Yeah, but and it, you get to go through them and look at the patterns, and yes. you can pick, choose them. Now, some some people they have them at different prices too. Yes. Oh, some of them can be very very expensive. Like they have some that mm. are like twenty five dollars a pattern, but they're like a vintage specialty. Mm -hmm. You know. Um, the, the ones I'm going to show today shows some of the variety that there is out there. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. But, um, before we get started. <laughs> yes, let's do our inspirational saying. Da, da, da. Okay, our inspirational saying. Mm -hmm. mm, excuse me. Um, first I'm going to tell you this is from a Dutch proverb. So. It says you... Dutch proverb. Yes. <laughs> so, what does that mean? Oh, you looked it up? I did. Well, good. What does it mean? Well, a proverb is a pithy expression stating wisdom believed to be true by the majority of the people of okay. the population. But, so then I had to look up pithy. Do you know what that means? A proverb is a pithy expression. No, explain. Concise and forceful. Oh, okay. Concise and forceful. Yes. Uh, stating wisdom believed to be true by the majority of the population. P-I-T-H-Y? Pithy? Yeah. P-I-T-H-Y. You can start using that word now. Mm -hmm. I think that word could be easily misconstrued in today's sentences. Pithy or pity or... <laughs> yeah. Okay. So here's what the Dutch proverb actually is. Okay. <clears throat> she who is outside her door already has a hard part of the journey behind her. Yeah, sometimes you can't, people can't th get themselves out the door. So, how do I apply this to sewing? Sometimes we don't start. Oh, yeah. Because we're mm -hmm. afraid what's behind the door. Or, or that pattern's afraid. too hard, that fabric's too good, that what if I mess up? What yeah. if it doesn't fit? What if it, the, all the I got more fit. fabric than what it calls for. <laughs> That's but, what would be you. Yes, but, but I liked that. I mean, it is a true saying. And sometimes um, when people are depressed, mm -hmm. That's the hardest thing for them to do is to get out their front door. Yeah, or if you have a phobia or something, or fear of something. Sometimes you don't even know what it is. You just can't get it done. You just can't move well, forward. Well, that's pithy. <laughs> <laughs> so that's our saying, get out that front door. P-I-T-H-Y is what she said. Yes. So, <laughs> are we going to do every other one? We are, um, and mine is just what I had gotten from the the one time that I had ordered with Doris, okay? Which I still have to pay her for. <laughs> I see, I got that right here. <laughs> her little bill. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so she's going to show seven patterns. Is that correct? Yes, I have seven of them. So then I picked out seven of mine. Oh, and I have a variety, too. Well, I have McCall's New Look and Simplicity. So. I have Quick Sew Park Bench Pattern Company, oh, New Lork, Vogue, McCall's Butterwick, and Simplicity. Okay. Because I just want to show there's <clears throat> such a variety out there. Yeah. Of patterns. Yeah. And, like, even my Vogue's was $1.25. Yeah. Which is amazing, because I can never find them that cheap. Yeah. Ever. Yeah. Uh, maybe at Goodwill once in a while I'll find a pattern for 99 cents. I haven't had much success. But there hasn't Goodwill. been very many mm -hmm. patterns in Goodwill. No. Maybe all really. these pattern de-stash Facebook people are buying them and then selling them on Facebook. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. 
Who knows? So, anyway, so my first one is Butterwick. Okay. 4516. Isn't it a cute top? A That's cute a very cute top. top. Yep. I really, really liked the just the basic cute top. You know, yeah. summer top, a tank. So, and it is um, a very easy, and it is, I'm sorry, go ahead, you bring it in closer. Yeah. And it calls for stretch knits to make that that top, so. Ah. And that looks like it's, it'll be a nice one to make for the summer. And it has several different details. Oh, look, it could be a, a beauty queen. How about that? Yeah, that's cute. Yeah, so you have the sash, you have the sash on the one, and then the tie with a bow on the one shoulder. Mm -hmm. So, and it looks like that's separate because you have the sash and then the, then the little tie there for the bow. Okay. So anyway, that was my first one. It's a fast and easy butterworth. Great. My first one I'm gonna show is a quick sew, 3125. I think it's really cute. Um, it is, uh, does it say what year this one is? It doesn't. But this one has not, you know, it's never even been opened. Um, and you would look at that, and I thought when I bought it, I'm like, well, that kind of looks like it could be something with knits, right? Uh-huh. It's yes. not. It's made with light, medium weight woven fabrics, like cottons and cotton blends, rands, and so forth. Here is the, <laughs> here is the line drawings. Yeah. So, Very cute, nice. cute pattern. Cute. And it is quick, so it does look like it would be easy to me. Quick start, this is a learn to sew. Oh, so it will be. So it'll be easy. And then the skirt does have elastic waistband. But I like that the top is not tight here. It loose, loosely hangs over it. I think and, that would be flattering. And the skirt looks like it's just the front and the back to it. Not a four panel, but just the front and the back. Yeah, and you can have it longer or shorter. Nice. Yeah, so... Yeah, I think, I think that would be cute. Let's see if I can find the year on it. Yeah, I don't not. see it anywhere. It might be inside the pattern. Yeah, it may be. Yeah, it's printed. Oh, it's probably, it's M-M-I-I, -I for those who know Roman numerals. I would have to look it up. Now my hubby knows Roman numerals. Excellent. M-M -M would probably be 22. No, it's not 22 yet. <laughs> okay, 10, 10, 10. Don't ask me. M -M I used to know. I, X I used is 10. To. I don't know what M is. Yeah, John, my husband knows. He he knows how to do that. He. Well, you know what? I'm going to look it up and put it in here. There you go. There we go. Okay. Thank goodness for editing. Mm. Okay. Oh. <gasps> my next one is a new look, and it looks like it's a wardrobe type. A, a wardrobe? A wardrobe. It's uh, 19 pieces to make the entire outfit. So it is new look. Six, four, one, three. There we go. Oh, yeah. So, you know, you've got a long version Love of the jacket, coat. a short version. You've got a skirt. Is that a skirt? Yeah, a skirt. Yes, that is. And then you have um, the dress. And then a tank. And then a tank. Cute. So this looks like a very versatile. And it, it uses uh, suggested fabrics or wovens. Okay, and it does take a 22-inch zipper for the tank top. And, really? And the dress. I would not put a 22 inch zipper in there unless it's extremely form fitting. Yeah. And it has, it has the fisheye darts in there too. So oh. I don't know. We'll see, but it's very nice. I like that. It's kind of got that Chanel look, you know, to the jacket. And I like those yeah. kind of clean lines. So, so yeah. very nice. You have some, uh, what is it called? Boy, bo vocal, vocal, bocle, bocle fabric. No, I can't say it because you've got it all messed up. Oh, well, sorry. That's okay, but I have some fabric that's perfect for that, that type of jacket. Yes. yes. So here's one, like, I had never even heard of this company called Park Bench Pattern Company. Had you ever heard of it? No. Mm -mm. And it's in Niagara Falls. So I just thought, this is cute skirt. I like the jacket. And the jacket is cute, too. I like the design on the jacket. Yeah. So, um, yes. <laughs> so, yes. This uh, is a 1999 pattern, and I, I have done no research on Park Bench, but I should to find out whether it's still around or not. Um, I do like the cut on the jacket. It has a lot of details to yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. Look at the, the draw, line drawing. So it has it so you can do contrasting fabrics. <laughs> oh, excuse me. But it's cute to me. It's cute. And you have two looks to the skirt. 
You can either have that little little dipper thing in it. That little high low thing. Or, or you can have a little ruffle on the bottom. Yeah. But um it looks like the jacket is loose fitting, which I like. Now does the jacket have two different let me see the fronts. No, it's both the same. Yeah, they're both the same. Only yeah. only the difference is see this one has the contrast fabric yes. here and this has the contrast fabric here. Mm -hmm. So that's the only difference that it's showing you um how you can use different yeah. fabrics. Yeah. So, so cool. Very yeah. nice. Pattern number 21. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, my next one is a Simplicity number 4487. And it is some nice basic tops. To me, that looks like a nice basic top to make. Um, and you have different variations with the sleeves. You can have uh, all sorts of different sleeve variations. You can have just the long, the long straight. I can't see exactly what I'm pointing at. <laughs> But I know that one Mommy has point. a large <laughs> cuff on it uh, with a poofy sleeve. And then there is a short, just a short puffy sleeve with a, a band around it. And then there is, um, yeah, a runch sleeve on, down there by the wrist with the ties on oh, it. Oh, yeah, that's view B. So there's lots right of here. variation with the sleeves on that. Yeah. So, and it has a collar um, on the neckline. It's, and what a cute sash, huh? Yeah, very cute sash. So that's a nice versatile net that's made out of wovens and it's buttoned down in the front, so. And do we know what year this one is? Uh, well, it's probably know? right here. Oh. 2005. Yeah, 2005. But, you know. It's not even 10 years old yet. Oh yeah, 2015. <laughs> But it's, it's over. It's, what I meant to say is it's over 10 years old. Yeah, and it just it's, but a it's nice cute. basic top. It's yeah. a nice basic blouse. Yeah. So those, you know, the design elements are there. Mm -hmm. So it's just a matter of changing up the fabric. Yeah. So very, very nice. My next one is New Look 6009. Mm -hmm. 6009. And this one is from 2010. But that style is one that I could wear no matter what year it is. <laughs> I like this a lot. Now it has it either um, straight, which I like the straight rather than this, the, the gathered here. It's like a little gather around oh, yeah, the waist. Oh yeah, that's really cute. Yeah. yeah. But I like, I like the straight top. And this is um, cottons and silks, charmous crepes. Yeah. So this is a cute pattern, 6009. And of course with new look, this one has size 10 through 22 in it. Oh, nice. So, yeah, you can shrink or grow, whatever, or be stay the same <laughs> and use that pattern. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. So this one here is another simplicity. It's called the So Easy Pattern, and this is from 1992. Ooh. So this is an oldie, and you'll be able to see that right away in the, the fabric choice and the design there. But it looks like just a, a nice dress again yeah uh they are shirt waist which mm -hmm. i thought maybe it was you know just a straight sheath but it is not they both have the top bodice which is joined uh at the waistline with the skirt so you can have the fuller version or the straighter version and um it looks like it should be a pretty easy pattern and it's made out of woven so i think you just update that a little bit with the fabrics yeah and it'll be good does it say it's easy by any chance it does right here it's, it's so, so easy. It's so easy. It's so easy. There we go. So I'll see what that means. Yeah. Now, does it have a zipper then in the back? No. Oh, yes. Yes, yes. Yes. Zipper in the back. Yes. Oh, it's yeah. 22 inch zipper, of course. Oh, okay. yeah. Oh, oh, and this even going back to that time frame, half inch shoulder pads. Which you could leave out. <laughs> I will leave out. Yeah. So that might mean a sleeve adjustment. Because oh. that might go over. Oh, really? Yeah. So I'll have to see how that goes if, if and when I go to make this. Okay. But this pattern, interestingly, has all the sizes in it, 8 to 20. Really for a simplicity. Isn't that interesting? Yeah. yeah. All, all right. right. The next one I got is a very easy Vogue. Very easy Vogue. Very easy. V8263. I love. It's just, oh, it has the jacket, the pants, and the shorts. That's nice. And I love the jacket. It's just so cute. It yeah. is cute. It's a cute jacket. Now, this one is from 2007, but it's really cute. Here's the line drawings on it. Um, 
It is made out of lightweight gabardine linen crepe. Yeah, so this has also has shoulder pads in the jacket. That's interesting. Jacket mm -hmm. has shoulder pads because that was what was now what year popular. was that one from? 2007. Yeah. Yeah. Just getting out of that. Yeah. Frame. But cute jacket for sure. The pants aren't bad either. Actually, they're pretty cute. They have a back zipper instead of a front. And it's not like it's, the, the pants have a back zipper that aren't like, they're, they're not hidden. It's an exposed zipper. Is that the correct word? Hmm. <laughs> okay. What you got next? <laughs> what I have next, this one is from 1993. I went up a year from 92 to 93. Ooh. So this, this is a McCall 6669. Now, for it's an online jacket, and it's very difficult to see any details. Online. Okay. Yeah, I thought you said it's an online jacket. I'm like, you mean you can buy it online? No. That's where you got it. It's online. No <laughs> lining in the jacket. But I thought it was very difficult to see any details in that jacket from those pictures. Yeah, you can. There, really. And... No there, line drawings. There's no <laughs> line drawings on it. Oh, that's um, funny. But I did pull this out. I pulled out the instructions oh, there you so go. you could see. And it looks just like um, there's not a lot of details to that jacket. It, it looks like like a Carhartt work yeah. jacket Yeah. in that design. And so I think it would be a nice, you know, yeah. it'll be a nice jacket. Just kind of run around jacket. We'll see. And they do have, they do have one of them. Where is it? View A, you can put a drawstring around the waist to, oh. to tie it in. Okay. So, yeah. Sometimes with jackets, that's nice because you can look so bulky. Well, yeah, yeah. And it keeps the wind out, too. So, and this particular pattern has um, extra small, small, and medium. Oh, I hope medium fits me. <laughs> that will be, I wonder which one. Yeah, well, I don't know. The medium, 12 to 14. Ooh. But you look at the finished bust size, uh, size, I'm pretty sure it's going to be big because... I don't think so. No? The measurement at bust finished for a medium is 30... No, that's the back length. Oh, back length. <laughs> yeah. Woo! It's not 32 inch bust. Oh, yeah. The hip line's 54. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so it'll be say, big. It'll be fine. Yeah. It'll be good. Yeah. Yeah. Woo! Because it's, <laughs> it's a jacket. Yeah. Next one I have is a McCall's. Uh, five, eight, four, that four. That is cute. I like that. Isn't that cute? I love the detail that on that really dress. That is really cute. Isn't that darling? What year is that one? Uh, it's right here. It's right here. Oh, it is? 2009. But I really like this. I love this. It is cute. With the little... Nice details. Little detail. So, here, oh. <laughs> here's the line drawing. You can kind of see in the line drawing. So, they have that extra fabric in the front. I really think this is this would be a fun one to make. Slightly flared, fitted slightly flared dress. Yeah, below mid knee or above ankle length, whichever you prefer. And it takes, um, the suggested fabrics are the chalet, um, double georgette. Something light and flowy. Light and flowy because, you know, you're gonna have all this extra fabric here. Yeah. You, you don't want, want it heavy. stiff, anything yeah. stiff. You want something that has a good movement to it. Yeah, it's a good buy for $1.25. Okay, now this is something that, um, this pattern here, if you make this, it could look, it really depends on the fabric you make this out of this to how it's going to look. This is a Simplicity 8071, uh, 1998. I'm moving up. <laughs> I'm getting there. 1998. <laughs> yeah. Now, I used to wear a lot of those dresses. That's cute. I have some dresses like that in my But closet. it depends oh. on... Your fabric, fabric. Yeah. and the design on the fabric. Because you don't want to look dowdy. You could look really dowdy in that. Or you could look really like, you know, somebody, if you got to, yeah, you just really have to be careful with the fabric that you're going to choose. For yeah, that, to make I think work. that's a lot, that's true with a lot of the older patterns. A lot of it is just, what fabric are you going to use yeah. to make it, whether it looks modern or not? Or like you said, taking the shoulder pads out or putting shoulder pads in or yeah. whatever. And this one, I like the description. It says, dress with full skirt gathered to bodice at raised waistline, seam hat, waistline seam. Has round neckline and a back zipper. I love that description. And then it talks about it has patch pockets. View A has patch pockets and ribbon rosettes. C, D, and E has short sleeves. D is cut crosswise at the border. There's a lot of detail. Yeah. 
versus nothing that you get now. I know. I know. <laughs> Absolutely nothing that you get now. So anyway, it's made out of wovens and um, it, it'd make a cute summer dress. It sure would. Yeah. So there you go. Now, do you think you could make that out of a knit and it still would turn out okay? Even though it says wovens? Because that to me looks like it would be a cute you could knit do, I, I would fabric. think you could do a jersey knit, a yeah. light, yeah, yeah. you know, a jersey knit, but I, you wouldn't want to make it out of anything stiff. You right. You'd have to right. really have something Like soft. I was thinking like a t-shirt jersey knit. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. This next one is Butterwick 4243. Again, I, you know, it's funky, so I like it. 2004. I really like the cut of this. I think it's nice. It's fun. Yeah. And you can make the skirt. You can have a pocket or not pocket on the little top. You have short sleeved or long sleeved. And you can have um, the pants long or you can make them shorter. So it's an easy pattern. Um, semi fitted top, has sleeves and shaped hem. Um, what do you use? Linen ran and staple knits. So here's all the line drawings for Butterwick 4243. And see now, I think that's still timely. I mean, I think that's still yeah, it's cute. It's still a look that people still mm -hmm. wear. Yeah. Or maybe it's come back. Or maybe I just want it to come back. I'll make it come back. Two thousand four. Okay. Well, I moved up to two thousand four finally. Oh. So I'm in there, and this is the McCalls, and this is easy, endless options. So wow. This has. This could take a while to describe it. <laughs> yeah. Well, it has, Endless the, options. it has the slacks in it, it has the dress oh. in it, it has the jacket, it has a duster, you know, and um, so there you go. It doesn't really have a skirt to it. Well, they left out the skirt. No, but they have a little tanker top. And a nice, yeah, with a square neckline. Yeah. So That's nice. You know, there's a lot Spinning. of options to this. It says it's 11 pieces. It's made with lightweight wovens. And, um, Yeah. A lot of different options you could do with that. They're just basic, basic patterns. So the pants have an elastic waist around it. Oh, and the jump, the dress or the jumper, that could be a jumper depending on how that fits, is a square neckline also. Yeah. With darts. Oh, so, sorry. Yeah, I'm boring her <laughs> sorry. terribly. She did warn us it was. <laughs> yeah, endless options. Endless options. So anyway, and they give a really detailed description with everything. Uh, regarding the patterns, which I'm not going to go through. Let's see, does it have a zipper in here? I just want to check the notions. No. Nope, nope, nope. There you go. Because so, of the square neck, you can probably just get it on. Because of the square neckline, you can put it on. That's nice. Yeah, they do have, it's like a little um, opening in the back with the button closed. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so anyway, that's it for my patterns. And this one came uh, with, at this time, they changed, started changing up the sizes. Um, into the patterns. This is a 12 through 18. Okay. Oh, the last oh. one I have is a Simplicity 3867. I just think it's so cute with that little tie in front. Let me see, I can't see it. It's very cute. See oh, that it tie? is adorable. And the dress has that too. Yeah. It, it even has sweet. this little, little jacket. That's cute too. This was a 2000, um, I just looked at it. <laughs> 2000 seven pattern a uh, simplicity and it comes with the dress i like the jet is it the, is that the, the cool. jacket yes jacket and what are those those are like uh i would call them a short now see yeah city shorts they're called city, city shorts. shorts and it also has a bag in it this little bag how cute it has that in here isn't that cute and this is from um it says up here from the publisher of threads Basic oh. learning to unleash your creativity. So stylish. Basic learnings. I have found that sometimes those have been challenging. I love that little it, she, jacket. She's talking about this view here. Yeah. I like the little jacket. Yeah, it is cute. Yeah. Threads. I used to get the Threads magazine. They so still make it. This particular okay. one has pattern size 14 through 22. So yeah. that, that's nice too. But that's it for that particular... Yeah, just a sampling of what you can get off that site. And she, no way, no way, we, we're not endorsed by them. We're just sharing a yeah. resource that we found that we thought people could utilize because not everybody, like Dory said, we have, live close enough to some place that they can go and get 
their patterns when they're on sale. And sometimes that gets to be a, a problem too because you can't always get there when they're on and, sale. And sometimes you see patterns that someone has made and maybe it's an older video or it's an older pattern. Yeah, And, you and you're that. like, I want that. Well, you might be able to find it. On that site. On that site. And she puts, there's new things coming constantly All the there. time. I cannot yeah. believe it. And you gotta be careful. <laughs> Because otherwise you're gonna have so much you're gonna have to destash. <laughs> yeah, I could already do that. I yeah. know you definitely could. I could, but I collect them. <laughs> oh yeah, I don't consider mine a collection. <laughs> oh, I do mine. Definitely a collection. Okay. So um, don't forget, she who is outside her door already has a hard part of the journey behind her. We stepped so. out the door. We already have the hard part behind us. Now all we have to do is make them. That's right. <laughs> there you go. How's that sound? Works for philosophy <laughs> <laughs> okay so thank you so much for watching today don't forget to leave a comment yes forward hit the like button subscribe and uh, passes on well that's what forward does passes on <laughs> to your friends and um, like us yeah and let us know if you uh, go on to that Facebook page sometime yeah yeah and how it'd be interesting to see if other people are enjoying yeah. it so, so thank you very much right. have a good week sewing and step out that front door see you all next right. time happy sewing bye, bye.